Hi, hi, everyone. Very good morning, and uh, very good morning to see you all join early in the morning at ten o'clock on the Sunday to learn about this indicator. Yeah, it's a it's a it's a very very long day, and uh, for me. But uh, in spite of that, I want everyone to attend this uh, session because uh, it's so much of things to be learned in this indicator. And um, and the problem here is people get carried away and what to do and where to take where to take a trade and everything. So before getting uh, the thing started, we need to know the basic uh, settings that you need to do while um, while taking the entry. So this is the when I gave access to everyone, you should get a indicator called range of the market. So when you get the range of the market, you should make sure that go to settings and then change this five minutes to chart. Okay, this is the first settings that you need to do. And when you do that, the values will be intact and your your uh, studies will be very good. So time frame should be on chart and you can have all these things, but if you don't need, right, if you don't need anything, uh, you, can, you can remove this as of now, I'll be teaching all this stuff. So uh, you can also remove it. First, let's learn one by one, and then we'll get to know more about it. Okay, so this is the main setting that you need to do, and then say okay. And one more setting that uh, people may say that there is two, there is no two lines, or it is getting, it's, I'm getting only single line, and not getting anything there. In that case, you need to go to settings, this setting button here, click on the setting button, and go to symbols. And in session, you should see that regular trading hours should be selected. It should not be extended trading hours. Make sure that you have a uh, regular trading hours selected and say okay to it. So when you do that, it will give you the, the range of the market. So this is the range of the market. So what is this range of the market is all about? So when, when you say that uh, range of the market is, uh, is, the, is the range marked by the institutional players, that means that uh, this is a range, basically, uh, indicate uh, uh, indication that uh, the institutional players want to book their profits because they don't want a uh, bigger profit because they they don't carry it away. They if they short it, they will cover it at some point point of time, and if they go in long side, they will take profit at particular instance. So those these two levels are like like this two green level and these two red levels are the main uh, area where most of the trades are going to happen. So how to take a trade? So I'm not going to uh, tell about anything about this green line, this uh, red line now. First concentrate on this, these two green line and these two red line. So way to take a trade, okay? So let's say people will uh, go for a trade. Let's say people will go for a trade when, uh, as everyone, as retailers will know, when uh, day high is broke, okay? And then <clears throat> when do, day low is, is uh, let, let's say if a day low is broken, people go for a trade. And when day high is broken, people will go for a trade, correct? So when these two levels are uh, broken, people go for a trade. And also they see some uh, previous level, day before level, that and all I don't teach, right? You know that very well. So I don't care about yesterday's low and day with yesterday's low. We concentrate on the particular area where the institutional players will take profit. So, okay. So if this is a case, if it breaks on the IS side, if it breaks on the IS side, will I go for a trade? If it breaks on the IS side, will I go for a trade? No, I will not be going for a trade because if I go for a trade, my profit will be around this area alone, like 36 points which I don't like, okay? And then if it's very good, na, if it's very good and the moment is very good, you will get a profit only around 69 points. So if it's a bigger profit, I can go for it, but you will be risking yourself, but because we, the, pro, the stop loss is so heavy, you cannot take a stop loss around this level. You cannot take a stop loss around this level. So this is too bad, na? So you're getting, you're getting into a situation where you have to take a loss of around 68 rupees for getting a profit of 68 rupees. It's one is to one. That is, that is not at all good. 
so you should not go for a trade whenever it is on the upside of it okay don't not take a trade if 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 my stock goes above this area first time i repeat if it's first time you can go for a short and have a stop loss above it you can have a stop loss above this line okay or somewhere down the year you can have a stop loss around here do not take a short when it crosses above this level okay so you you do not take a long so this area is not for long this area is not for long entry any script whoever whoever gives any scripts for trading do not take any scripts which is coming near to this level or to this level okay make sure that the script is gone above this level for a trade the script should be touching here and it fit reverse right that is a script should be taken for a trade for a long trade do not take a script which is uh, near year like year if someone gives you a long will you take a trade no you should not take a trade if someone is giving a trade year will you take a trade no you should not take a trade if someone is giving a trade around the year will you take a trade no trades because it's all short trades because when when the when the stocks goes when the stock goes from year and then it's year first time it is always a sell and then if the stock wants to go up you know if the stock wants to go up it will hit this level and it will be coming down to this level and it should take a support from this level it should take a support from this level for moving further up when it takes a support from this level you can go for a long and then have a stop loss below this there may be one week or two weeks will be below this level have that as a stop loss and go for a ride you will get a beautiful result for this okay do not enter breaking this level you should be on the short side you should not be on the long side when it's this level the stop loss is broken you should be in the short side and not on the long side i repeat it again and again because this is where most of the people get carried away it is going on a uptrend sir it is going on a uptrend sir i want to take a trade so what shall i do so you have to exit here if you're not exiting here if it comes out on this area exit here these two are your prime area for exit if you're not exiting here then you will you are you will have to give your profits if you are lucky the stock will go on the upside and then it could be a unidirectional move okay and then okay when it crosses above this area let's say uh, the the stock goes above this area let's say it is crossing this area what will be your profit booking your profit booking or will be on this line the dotted lines here na this will be your first level of booking area okay and then if it crosses above this level we have a second level of booking area so these two area should be considered for profit booking so that means that whenever whenever a stock is breaking this level whenever a stock is breaking this level if you are taking a trade you should book a trade on the first attempt around this area first attempt on this area and then because it will come down and it if it's reverse from here take that as a low and then go for a kill but i do not expect to you to take a trade because i don't want to take a trade here because if it goes above this line then you can take a trade for a target of this but if the level is so so small will you take a trade here no i will not take a trade at all here so when it crosses this level that means that i know on a particular day this this uh, script had broken the range it has a tendency to go upper 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 so that is how you should take a trade so when it so where you take a trade when it crosses the higher of this line and it stays on the above side you take a trade okay this is on the long side okay and say if i am if i am as a trader i am as a trader right if i am a trader where will i take a trade okay 
I do not take any trade around this area. Even if it crosses above, I don't take a trade. For me, how will I take a trade is my taking trades area is this is the area I'll be taking a trade. This is my important area for taking a trade because when I take this trade, I will be getting a good results. Okay, how this is possible, sir? Yeah, because when it comes down, first attempt, when it touches here, it will reverse. And then in the second attempt, it will try to break this line and it will come and support in this line. This, this is the maximum support level. Okay, if this is a maximum support level, if it comes and if it's reverse from here, I will be taking a trade. Don't consider this uh, moving average. I'm not considering this moving average. If this comes and goes above, I'll be taking a trade. But make sure that this trade is on the upside. It is breaking the level of this level also. When this also breaks, I have a target of this much. See the, see the beauty of it? If I take a trade from here, let, let me show you. If I take a trade from here, from this level, let's say I'm taking the trade from here. My target is what? 133 points, right? So if I take a trade from here, 133 points, what will be my stop loss? My stop loss is only around this area, somewhere around this area, there may be a wick on this area. So I'll take that as a stop loss and I'll be taking a profit of 133 points with just mere five rupees, six rupees stop loss. So you do you like that, right? You, you like that five rupees stop loss with 133 rupees, which is very, 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 very good. So you need to have that kind of a strategy and you should not have a strategy which is very, very low. Say if I take a trade from here, the breaking of the high, your target is only 31 points. Will you take it from year to year is 133 points. So you're going to risk the for 31 points. You're going to risk 38 points. And if you're lucky, it will go from year to year. It is around same one is to one. But from here, if I take a trade, it one is to two. I get 136 point for sure. Okay. So this is how you need to take a trade. You should take a trade on from the lower level. I repeat it again because this is very, very important where, where most of the people are getting caught. Okay. So let's take an example here. Uh, let's take the previous day example. Okay. Okay. See so in this case, right? So here, see the stock comes down. This is a range of the market. One, two, three, and four. These four are the range of the market. It you should not take a trade on the upside. I said no. You I'll be looking out for a trade from the lower side. So it comes down and it is not hitting the area, but it is going above the area. So there is a possibility of going above the area. So if I'm been there. I'll be waiting for the level because this is not a reversal strategy. If someone is not watched, uh, if you're not watched about my reversal strategy, please watch the reversal strategy and then look into this, this look at this video. How the reversal strategy works is if there is a fall, if there is a reversal is happening, the green wick should be bottom of the red wick. Okay. That is where the reversal app started. If you, if you think that it is hitting this area, so I have to go for long, you will be on the wrong foot. So in this case, it is falling and the green wick is above the red line. So this is not a good sign for taking a trade. In this case, we have a red wick here. We have, we have a red wick here. And then the green wick is below the red wick. So if that is below the red wick, what you have to do here is you need to mark a rectangle kind of a thing here and then make this as a reversal point. This will be a reversal point and you take a trade having a stop loss below this area. So this is the area you should have a stop loss and you can take a trade. So when you take a trade on this, 
will the stop loss hit here it will hit here but you would have got somewhere around this area you got beautiful profit here but if it hits and if it goes above you have to take a trade there is no other go that it should not fall down because here under candle moving average is come and hit the area but if it falls you have to exit and second thing is if it crosses above you have to take a trade again the same stop loss again the same target so see this so beautifully it went so this is what the main uh, thing so here also it is a falling and it made a reversal candle here so this is a next reversal candle it has formed you should mark like this so this will be your reversal strategy okay when you mark these two together we get a beautiful profit so again i repeat it's all the mindset that you have you should have a perfect balance between where to take a trade and what to take a trade so you already know that this area is the area for buying area so i already told you this area is a buying area this area is a buying area right so whenever it's buying area you have to look out for a reversal candle where the reversal candles are forming so this is the first reversal candle formed this is not a reversal candle this is not a reversal candle this is not the reversal candle this is also not a reversal candle this is still falling and this is the first reversal candle formed for the day so breaking the high of it take a trade breaking the low will be your stop loss take a trade you will give you will be getting beautiful profits and then coming down a bit again it comes down and then it says that i want to fall down let it fall down but in this case it has made a reversal candle so that means that i need to mark this area again this area again and i have to take a trade if i take a trade i have a target from here so let's say uh, how much of profit that would i have got with this uh, if i have taken a trade so my trade will be from here okay my trade will be from here till here it's 84 points is it not good okay so let's 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 go back here okay so in this case we have to take a reversal candle right we have to say a reversal candle for the trade so this one is going up okay this one is going up and this candle see this candle it is green wick on the top it is not the red wick it is on the green wick so it, there is a possibility of going above again okay so it is creating a area it is not a reversal candle still possibility of going up is still there intact but there is a possibility when when you see here it is going above and then it's still going above and that's where it's starting so that means that the candle should be higher than this candle here this candle is lower na this is higher if that is a case this will be a reversal candle you need to have this as a reversal strategy reserve reversal candle and you should take a shorting but you should exit around the under candle moving average this is very powerful this is very very powerful guys you should you should be you should be worried about this under candle area so that's where it should break for the trade if it's coming and hitting this area i'll be booking the profits i will not be holding my profit till the end okay try to play like this you will get a beautiful beautiful kind of a trade again i'll go back here let's say here in this case so it went all the way up right it went all the way up and then you got a reversal candle here we got a reversal at this area just mark this area okay you just mark this area and take a trade so you got around this area your target will be around this area right my target is around this area so that's where it hit the target and it came down so we already marked the area as a lowest area breaking this lower area i'll be going for a short right so i'll be going for a short other candles are not reversal candles these are all not a reversal candles okay so this is only the reversal candle breaking this low i'll be taking a short entry so after that everything fall so here in this case there is one reversal candle formed around this area 
I'll be risking with this candle for a trade, but it did not went up. It came down again. So in this case, how much of the profit that would have uh, you would have got? One is to fifteen, but how much the loss will be? Just two points or three points. It's very 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 good thing. You need to follow. Let's let's go here. It is falling around this area. and it did not touch any of this lines this lines it did not any touch it did not touch anything so it went all the way up but still you can also watch the reversal candle this is also a falling area this is also a falling area and then you find a reversal around this area so this is a reversal area which is formed you take this as a reversal area and see whether it is breaking this level if it's not breaking this level take this as a entry and go for a trade okay you can risk around this area because your stop loss is first time if it's it's this area it has to go up that's what i said na it was not hitting this area it is getting support from this area i'll take a risk if i take a risk i'll get a profit around here so in after hitting this area what happened it created a reversal zone this created a reversal zone from there it will fall so this is how if you take a trade you will succeed and uh, do not take anywhere let me go here one more one more round of trade so it is falling here this is falling 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 is this a reversal candle is this a reversal candle is this a reversal candle no these are not a reversal candle so i'll be waiting for a perfect reversal candle where is the reversal candle is there here 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 no here is the reversal candle this one is your reversal candle because the wick of the green is lower than the wick of the red so when you take this as a reversal candle you have to take a again you you have to take a entry around this area and then you have to take a short uh, you have to take a stop loss around this area so when you take a entry around this area you get a beautiful profit how much profit that you would have gain see there is no reversal happen anywhere anywhere from here see only this had happened reversal but it also broke so it has a tendency to hit when i break this level i said it has a tendency to hit this area na it has to tendency to hit this area it went and hit this area so 114 points you would have gain in fact you would have gain from the low 114 120 points okay let's let's take one more example so this is this is falling right this is going on the upside this is on the upside is going 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 we have a reversal candle here near to the range of the market if it's near to the range of the market you can make this as a entry for you like this this is a reversal pattern breaking this level we have to take a shot and then this will be your stop loss when you do that it will fall 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 near this area you need to watch out for what you need to watch out for reversal candles right so is there a reversal candle around this area is is uh, what is this point is low is 115734.30 this is 15734.15 which is lower green is lower you see red is 1515 you watch this this area so when the green uh, red is 1574.30 the green is 1734.15 which is a reversal candle so here i'll take this as a reversal and just a line because it is not a bigger wick so i'll just take an entry like this i'll make it like a wick here so breaking this high i'll be taking a trade it went up so though it come down we have a level around this area i'll be taking a trade when it comes down here also i'll be taking a trade so i'll be risking from here na i'll take somewhere from here also i'll take another lot for at the moment so i'll do not get into a loss okay one more okay this is another level so let's say this is going 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 on the upside it's going on the upside is there a reversal candle here green is on the top red is on the bottom it is not a reversal candle okay this is not a reversal candle this is not a reversal candle this is a reversal candle high is what 
one five eight double zero point two five, which is year eight zero zero. This is a reversal candle. So this is, I'll take this as a reversal candle. And one more reversal candle is formed around this area. So this is another reversal candle is formed. I'll be marking this also. Again, it formed another reversal candle around this area. So this is the final reversal candle it formed. This is the final reversal candle formed. So that's where it started falling. Okay. So all you have to do here is you have to wait, 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 and take a trade. Where to wait to take a trade? Near to the level of the range of the market. You cannot take a trade between the range of the market. If we take a trade around this area, you should take a trade above this line and make sure that there is no reversal candles are forming. If the reversal candles are forming, please book your profit and get out from the stock. Getting it? Okay. So this is the first part of the lesson in the indicator. The second part of the lesson is you have another two lines will be forming. Okay. This is the range of the market. I said there will be some more occasion where you find another two more lines will be created. I'll show you. So let's say this one. Yeah. Yeah. This one. You have another line created here. I'll remove the both the lines here. I remove both the lines. So now you see there are two lines created. These are red and this is green. So these two are another level of support. It's modified support of the range of the market. So whenever this is formed, you have to look out for a reversal around this area, right? So do I see any reversal area here in this area? Okay, I'll, I'll mark it again for showing I, sh I removed it. So do I see any reversal area around this area? Yes, it fall from here. We have a reversal candle around this area, right? This is a reversal candle because the green wick is below the red candle. So this is a perfect reversal candle right you can say sir this is also a reversal candle yes this is also a reversal candle okay so that means that i'll take an entry above this for a take a trade so in this case i would have made a loss yes you would have made a loss if you have taken a trade above this you would have taken a loss but when again when you take a trade from here this area you would not have taken a loss you would have taken a profit Every time the market will not give you a profits. Sometimes it takes away your profits too. Okay. You need to accept your own mistakes and uh, it's not a mistake. In fact, we did a right entry here, but if the market is not uh, going up, it is not your fault. You did your right job, but the market did not accept that as a entry point. So this is a final entry point, which is much, 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 much powerful than this one because it did not touch the final range of the market but this one touched the final range of the market so this is have much much powerful than this one so when i when i take this entry here i should take an entry from here it should take an entry to the top so when where will we make profits here i should take an entry from here to here it's around 77 80 points we are not doing scalping here we are doing perfect short term trading on a single day your short time trading is just two hours or three hours for us. It doesn't, it doesn't mean that I need to hold for three months, four months. No, people are really struggling in getting a trade in Nifty and Bank Nifty, right or wrong. It is, it is really difficult to find a trade in Bank Nifty and Nifty. But when you see with my indicator and this reversal strategy, you can make a lot, lots, lots of money and you don't need anyone for support and you don't need any calls from anyone in the world just follow the follow the one which i taught you like the reversal strategy and the range of the market you can crack it and you can make money daily okay so this is the first part okay this is a second part though so that it is uh reversing it may it may break this level it may come down to this to this level also consider this also the green line green line which is forming on any particular stock 
between either in uh, somewhere year or somewhere on uh, before the year those are called modified range so you need to get you should respect those levels too i'll show you i'll show you how to respect that you no know? i'll show bank nifty let me move it <clears throat> Okay, I'll go to the uh, level yesterday level. See this. This is a. Uh, I'll I'll remove everything. So this is like say you have a green candle. You have a red line here. So this is the modified range. Do you see this? All day, almost all day, it is on the range of the market. It is modified range of the market. Took 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 support from the range of the market. This is modified range of the market. So it took from there, it went all the way here. It did not move up. It again came down. It trying, trying, trying. Finally, it moved up. So you should also watch out for this line. Same concept. This is a reversal candle. This is a reversal candle. Okay. So because the green wick is near to the green wick is near to the range of the market, and second thing is, it is. a reversal because the green is on the red side and this is a green candle so you should mark only from the low of the wick and to the low of the wick so when you mark that you find a range so this will be a range for the entire day and you will not have lost a single bit of money from this trade interesting sir why out out sir if you had taught me this earlier i would have made lots of money sir in this day I did not had anything to do, sir. I was really struggling to do what kind of a trade on this particular day. Seventh of July is expiry day. I was struggling to get it, sir. If you would have told me this, I would have waited on the particular stock. I would have not exited. I would have paid thousands and thousands of money. Let's say I may I may be a crore pati too, because I buy ten thousand lots and I take it like a uh, home around ten crores of twenty crores. right so it is it is very simple but when you have any and you try to execute right your mindsets your mindset gets carried away and you will try to uh, get into a area where okay i'm getting this is enough for me you exit when you exit it it's right like carried away like this so you cannot do anything but at least you find wherever the the range is being created and if the wick is near to this range take a trade do not take anything away from the thing you will not get any money if you want to have a safer trade and if you want to get a beautiful trade you have to take a trade wherever the range is there if its range is not there please avoid that kind of a script we have 1500 to 3000 scripts are available take any one of the scripts and work if you want to work on fundo scripts you have 200 scripts to 210 scripts are there so you just look into those scripts and then you take a trade why you been attached to one particular trade i don't know but if you are attached with bank nifty and nft you have to wait because uh, you have to wait for uh, the hen has to lay like right? you cannot go and uh, tear the hen and uh, get a egg out of it you will you will be the person who will be suffering because you will not get the egg and you will not get the chicken uh, hen alive it will be dead so the golden egg you will lose it same thing here you have to wait wait for the the particular script to come to you when you come to you when you see all the all the all the strategy which i'm saying it is all together take a trade from there jump into a trade you will get a beautiful trade so you get to know now what is this red line and green line right this line and this line these two are very important levels to be watched okay and then now comes the important part okay these are very important parts and then there is another important parts which we need to know you see a flag kind of a flag kind of a zone created one two and then this three okay it doesn't happen on every basis every day it doesn't happen see here in this day whether the range has happened here no it did not happen here did it happen on the bottom side no it did not happen because whenever my script finds a find a zone which is made by the institutional players it will highlight in the indicator itself it's an unique thing which i developed 
whenever there is an uh, there is a hidden support level or hidden resistance level created by the institutional players i will mark that as a zone and i show it in the indicator so this is where the zone created one and two zones have been created see that exactly hitting this area and came coming down though it crosses the uh, range of the market it should be unidirectional but in this case what happened the the range of the market and the hidden resistance played the major role for making it down okay so so please 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 watch out for this lines and these are these are very very important things there may be another one okay this is like overbought over um, overbought area this is like the if you overbought area it will be a selling area so this is also overbought area so that's a selling area for you but whenever you see a flag kind of a pattern like this a big uh, up and then a flag this is a flag this is like a flag to identify between um, this range and this one i made it as a flag so that i understand better this is formed by my eden uh, zone and this is formed by overbought or oversold area okay so whenever i see a green candle like this i will be cautious and i'll be exiting from the trade whenever it falls on the below side if it comes to the near side i'll be taking a support from this level because i know this is a support area for me so i'll be taking a area for going for a kill i'll be going for a state buy for it okay so this is this is main main thing in my indicator this is this is very very unique and you will not find it anywhere okay and this is the third thing on the support resistance so all three together if you work all three together you will not get any kind of a losses okay and finally when you, you have this uh, this moving average right this moving average is so unique that whenever you see uh, um, hitting this area it will reverse and also you should be cautious see this here in this area it is red right and then it gone to uh, yellow and then from here this candle around this candle it turned to green if you see this this turned to green and from there you see a beautiful up move okay again from this candle it is turned to green right so it is telling me there is a beautiful up move is still pending so after that you see so big move have come so if you if you treat this as a trend indicator you can has this as a trend indicator or if you want to work only as a moving average it can work as a moving average okay so there are areas to be considered way to take a trade see this 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 is was this was a red right this was a red but my line just turned to green but this is a green later only this turn green with this candle itself so if i take a trade from this area it would have given me a beautiful this much move right and also see here it is falling and it is turning to orange this one from green it has turned to orange you should have exited from here okay so if you treat this as a trend catcher or trend um, levels or trend decider you can use that as a trend for your trade it will work like that okay so this is the third thing and um, there is one more in there let me bring it up so you have a cloud right we have a cloud here so this is a cloud okay this is a cloud so it will take a support from all the way till the bottom till here it will take a support you have to wait till the area it's broken for completely sell so it will also change the pattern it is it is here in this area it is changing from the short side to the long side okay it is not somewhere stop here if someone is looking at the cloud as a, as a as a step for uh, taking a trade it is like a crossover the red is here the crossover has happened the red part is completely gone now it is orange you should be cautious when it's turned to orange you should see for a reversal again do i have a reversal candle 
yeah you have a reversal candle here you have a reversal candle here so breaking this level you should take a trade and then start building up a trade you will get a very good trade so this is additional stuff for you there is one more stuff which is there is the fibonacci levels the blue lines okay the blue line are so so important where um, you should not watch for every now and then the first instance that is making right that should be the entry and exit let me show you okay this is where the first blue line got created okay this is where the first blue line got created and if you see that if it's it's the first time on the year it will come down and hit the first blue level one time at least if it's not hitting it will go and hit the second level and it will hit the third level so all three levels have been met and after all three levels are met it comes down okay so you have a target set by uh, from this level see with this level after crossing this level we have a target when it's it had has to go down by this much but there is a over sold area been created and also you have the level it's been it's it's all so now crossing down it is creating a uh, what is that called it is creating a zone and also it has already created a reversal here in this area this is also a reversal pattern so this is a falling and it has created a reversal pattern here so this area will not come and hit this uh, 2.618 will not hit so this one it takes an entry from here and it will hit this area 2.618 that is a target here so this is where you get an entry and you get a exit okay so this is what is all about in the fibonacci and then the final thing is on the red and uh, the indicator the long and the short indicator right so this is very very important just watch how to trade on this okay i removed this so that it's very much clarity will be there so i remove all the drawings so now you see you getting a reversal here okay so let's say uh, sir i i saw a level here so this is giving me a sell but why it went up sir so it is not like that brothers so this is a candle which is very very important for you to mark so this is a candle will give you a reversal point so when you have this kind of a candle like uh, aroma candle all you have to do is when i i say reversal candle now you are, you have to mark it so same thing when you see um the down area like this all you have to do is mark this as a high area breaking this area will be a long breaking the low will be the short breaking this low will be the short okay so here see it break the area and then your trade is on you got a beautiful profit again see here this is a area another area got created if this is a area got created you have this breaking this high you can take a long and breaking this low you have to take a short so after breaking this area you see how beautifully it came down it is not that you have to take a only on one side it is on both side okay this is a significant of this particular candle do not think that this candle uh, sir it is giving me a short and it is going on opposite sir i couldn't understand anything this candle when the arrow mark is on that particular candle that candle has some kind of a significant so all you have to do is you have to mark the high and the low of that particular candle and then take a trade if it breaks the low you have to take a short entry if it breaks on the high you should take a long entry see here breaking the high it went all the way up there breaking the low it's went all the way down okay so once it breaks this line you just do not consider this you just remove it okay have this as an entry and then take a trade okay do not worry about anything see here in this case we had a a uh, long entry right so this is a long entry it is giving me a long entry breaking the above this area so it is giving me a long entry after this this is where the long entry is but below this entry is a short entry so that means that below this is a short with this as a stop loss okay so this is all about my indicator 
so hope uh, you have i think let me see one more time whether i've covered everything i covered uh, this i covered this i covered uh, range i covered okay i didn't cover the uh, zones so this one is the zone which is created because of overbought area when the stock is going on the is side let us let's say the stock is going on the is side it will create an overbought area okay it will be a overbought area so that means people will be trying to sell from this area so when that area is formed you will be seeing a pink color line formed like this without any flags without any flags i repeat without any flags so this is this is a zone created no it is a flag see this there is a line here but for this there will not be any line here okay so that is the indication that you need to do and then see uh, here green is created what is green is all about over sold area so this is the area you should concentrate on buying area so think that as a perspective and take a trade okay so i'll take a break here for uh, next uh, 10 minutes you just have your uh, own uh, question and answers i'll answer all your questions and uh, let's see uh, how we can uh, trade together so as of now i'm taking a break and we'll i'll just join in another 10 minutes okay and till then you just uh, make make your notes for your questions i'll be answering all your questions okay take care just give me 10 minutes or uh, let me let me see one more time i'll unmute all uh, can you guys uh, unmute and talk can i see can i see yeah that's fine that's fine thanks a lot thanks a lot uh, you have a chance to speak and make sure that you're writing the notes and then we'll we'll talk further on this okay and one more thing those who joined in this uh, session please leave your uh, trading view profile id so that i'll give you exclusive access for one more month okay hope hope the session cleared most of your doubts right or wrong anyone please talk hope this session cleared most of your doubts Yes, yes, sir. It was an eye opener uh, for me. Yes. Hey, thanks, Sudhakar. Just, uh, just make some notes. Uh, if you have any any notes that you want to make, just make the note and give it to me, so that I can answer all the questions. Because outside people also will be joining, uh, watching this video, and if they watch the video, they have to see what is there in the indicator, na. So if you have some questions, please ask those questions. So I'll be answering those too. So it'll be a perfect uh, uh thing for uh. for the out outsiders too okay um okay. just give just give me 10 minutes and we'll get started again for next 45 minutes of question and answers alone okay take care guys i'll be back in 10 minutes okay in the meantime you can have a discussion and you can talk okay i'm passing the recording bye okay the floor is open you can ask any doubts any questions that you have anyone and please do not forget to have have your uh, profile id uh, in this uh, webex session so on in the zoom session so that uh, i take this i take this ids and give you access okay there are some people have uh, lifetime access do not uh, ask that you have already have a, a lifetime access so uh i don't think your people will be asking the others who don't have access to the indicator uh who have uh, trial access please ask them i'll provide them uh one month of free access okay hi hi good afternoon hi ajit how are you uh i am fine yeah ajita. you have not discussed the price action strategy later you have formulated that no i see people i didn't uh, give uh, the race concept here i have created another indicator where i not going to teach that as of now uh, because i have not given access to any of the person okay okay only for the prime members which uh, which uh, opted for uh, this range of the market indicator 
they have yeah. that price action uh, unique price action of uh, race it been given to them okay. others okay. i didn't given give it so first Can people ask like a flag a flag that is forming once again where this one the flag has been forming right the flag yeah, yeah. yeah the, this one you're talking about the flag right so okay yeah. so this one okay okay so whenever there is a there is a possibility of creating like whenever there is see there is a big red candle formed and then there are series of uh, candles have been formed right when i when oh, these yeah, three yeah. series of candles have been formed yeah. please yaar yeah, please please uh, uh, please uh, yaar yeah. so uh, let me uh, tell you one more time so when these kind of a pattern is formed the system will automatically pick up uh, what is happening on this particular uh, script and it automatically creates with uh, all these candles it will automatically create a zone saying that sorry sorry prem it is not going to uh, hit this level you have to be cautious at this level itself because there is a resistance at this level please no please do not wait for this level try to book your profit around this level getting the point same thing on the lead level so yeah. this is a level the, there's a flag kind of a thing formed here right this is not a zone it is a flag that is formed if it comes in this, this level please do not wait till this red line here it is a line it has to be formed here so here it will get a final support so that is how you need to treat getting the point yes yes and in yeah. fact right in fact right this is a zone which i marked na this is a zone i marked right when whenever you see this is a zone like this right i mark this as a zone okay this zone anywhere any time it get support and resistance so whenever this this candle comes around this area you need to check for the reversal zone straight away mark the reversal zone and take a trade that's it you don't need to wait for any kind of a strategy you don't need any strategy only thing which you need is reversal strategy which is already published in my youtube just watch that video again i have teach, taught you na this one is also good just watch this and take a trade you will you will always get into a profit zone you don't get into a loss i promise whenever you take a trade around the zone and then you do a reversal strategy you are done you are your your days are done you are not end up in any single loss on any single day right or wrong right right yeah thanks sir another question another question is that yeah after the reversal strategy yeah. whenever we make any entry like yeah. there in this skinny you are showing we yeah. have made an entry around this yeah. 11 105 yes okay should i wait for the whole day or Uh, see, yeah, uh, I say, I said, uh, whenever it breaks this level, whenever it breaks the upper level, I have a target of around from year to year, right? I'll be removing from year to year. This will be my target. Four ninety-eight points. I'll be having a target. As this is a bigger candle form, this is a bigger candle form, na. So I'll be changing my profit from year to the second. line itself this is my profit for the day i'll be booking my profit around this area 234 points if it comes that area i'll be booking a profit otherwise i'll be waiting till the day getting the point if it's sir, it's explain a, one more time sir so see uh, this is a bigger candle na so see see that this is a bigger candle first candle is a bigger candle form correct it's around uh, how much points 320 points right let's say 325 points is very big in bank nifty in the first 5 minutes okay so that means that i'll be waiting for um 60% of it right let me do a fibonacci levels here 60% of it is what from year to year i, I don't have the settings okay let me do the settings here okay i do the settings here somewhere around um Okay, I have zero point six one eight levels now. So when I do it from year to year, 
zero point six one eight level is here. So this level, I should book my profit. This is where the reversal should happen. So I'll be very cautious. So I, I'll, if I'm very cautious, what I'll do, I'll take my profit around this area. Otherwise, I don't take a profit. So this is where I'll be waiting for the profit. But if this candle also goes down, I'll be waiting a profit around this area. So I don't, I don't take any more profit. If I really want to have my profit, I should be waiting for this. If I don't want anything, then I'll be looking out for where, uh, wait, where the target. I don't have any target. I have to wait for till here. I don't have anything. If it hits, I will get a profit. If it's not hitting, I don't have any profits. I have to leave for the day. See, you are risking, yeah. You are risking your money, and you are not risking for a whole day. You are not risking for entire money. You are just risking five rupees, ten rupees. How much does a stop loss for this one? You are taking a trade. You are taking a trade from here. <coughs> Let me see. How much is will be your stop loss? The stop loss is around fifty-seven points. Fifty-seven points is your stop loss, and how much points that you got from fifty-seven points? From here till here, it is it is almost double, na. One is to two. You got the profit. So when you get one is to two, this is a this is a good thing, na. Right or wrong? Yes. So that is a, that's what you need to take a trade. So you can make one is to one or one is to two. Maximum one is to five also you'll get. I'll I expect for one is to ten, one is to five, one is to ten because my stop loss is very 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 small. So if that is the case, I'll take for a bigger profit. One second, ah. Huh? Yeah, go ahead with your next question, guys. Is that okay? Is I am I answered your question? Yes, yes. Okay, good. So, any other questions, guys? Sir, if we have arrow after and before reversal candle formed in higher and lower level, okay, what should we do, sir? So, this one you're talking? Yes, sir. So, after the reversal candle, you find a arrow here. Arrow. Yeah. Yes, so arrow is there, na? All you have to do is you have to mark this level, up the up this level, and uh, buy this, sell this level. But will you sell this level? I have no, the sir. reversal arrow in this area. Will you sell this level? No. I'll be going for a long this level. We already got long with this level, so I don't care with this arrow. It is also giving me a confirmation that it will be going up. So do not uh, get into a uh, short side. When you already found out a reversal candle, and also you are in the reversal strategy, and also you are in the long side, it is also giving you a long signal. Then be on the long side. Do not go for a short. Sir, what should the arrow indicate? In that indicator. This is a area. This candle has a significant that uh, you need to concentrate on this candle. If this is candle has lots of volume into it, there are lots of uh, what do you say? It has. Uh, uh it is like a candle where it gives you a either side movement it will go on the upside or on the downside so you should concentrate on that particular candle alone so that is the significance of it okay okay so you, you where the see here you have the candle here na you have this candle here yes okay you have a candle here breaking this level should be a long okay but it broke and then it fall na Sell up below this list as selling level, right? You got yes, one stop loss hit, but next time it did not hit the stop loss. You got how much big money? See, your 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 trading should be on one stop loss. You should not be exiting. You should not be exiting with one stop loss. Give another round of trade, you get very good profit. Okay. So sir, we can trail trail our profits. Do not trail. You are already on the right thing, na. You are on the right track. If you want to trail, see for another reversal candle and then trail it. Now, if you find here, if you have a short entry here, do I do I get a reversal candle here? Do I get a reversal candle here? Falling, 
falling yes, falling you get a reversal candle here yeah this area yes, this area you got a reversal candle above this exit finished off finished off so you get a profit until then you take a profit and enjoy right simple <laughs> yeah any other questions guys uh, sir good morning sir this is venkatesh varan hi venkatesh uh, sir uh, you have you have uh, in this chart you have given many many indicators for the buy and sell signals meant correct. that is the reversal points correct okay. correct so is there any priority or uh, uh, for which should i give importance in uh, uh, all these very very, very good very good very good questions so my first priority around this area this is my first priority area and this is my second priority area why i am giving selling area is a priority area is this is where the movement will be very very fast because when the shorter is getting carried away the movement will be very very fast because it's a short covering so my first priority is this second priority is this and uh, i'll be looking out for wherever the reversal is forming around this area or this area so that is the first thing that you need to do on a regular basis if you do that you get a beautiful beautiful profit other things are all supportive okay sir yes noted sir so this this area when the stock comes around this area you should be in a cautious mode that i need to buy i need to buy this particular stock if i have to buy the stock is there a reversal candle is formed do not get a carried away with this like the your reversal candle is formed right you can have a entry like this you have a entry this is a just a testing level this is one time movement okay this is this is not every time movement it's just a one time movement that it moved some you have to look out for the stocks which is coming around this area this area and then if it's it's a area and then you have a reversal candle then your moment will be around this area which is very 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 far and you get a very 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 good good profit so, so in this particular day 14th of uh, 14th you need to say i have to go for short from the top where it yeah. is creating the yeah yeah this is where the short this is where yes. the short is because it is it is it has gone up and it's created a, a selling area here and yes. also it's created a zone you see this this is a over buy zone yeah so okay. ra rather i'll be waiting because it's already there creating a selling zone it also giving me a selling it also giving me a over over bought area so all the way it is giving me a perfect sell you have one indicator you have a second indicator yeah. and also you have a third indicator it is also on the upside okay sir for this can i set a target of uh, until the sir target is your profit sir how much ever profit that you want you can have it <laughs> my my profit is always 1 okay. is to 10 okay sir okay what is a what is a candle height will be my profit 1 is to 10 i always look out for 120 rupees or 150 rupees profit in a particular script in a nft alone i will be looking out for at least 70 to 80 points 80 to 100 points will be my target because if i have 100 points as a target if i have 100 points movement i get 40 points in options okay sir no okay. doubt sir same Thank thing you. on the on the on the uh, bank nifty i will not go for 50 points or 100 points because these are all pure scalping you know they they have uh, seven points eight points if you get seven eight points because they'll be using under 1000 lots or 10000 lots which i don't want to do it i want to do with only 25 lot 25 is a one lot i'm going to trade with one lot i need to get money right i should be looking out for trade for 300 rupees or 400 rupees or even 200 to 500 rupees will be my target in bank nifty so that i get at least 200 rupees in options so that is how you should target you should not target with less amount like 100 points just 50 points or 75 points those are not movement it is just mere mere kind of a scalping movement which which i do which i hate a lot okay sir yeah 
just look out for the trade which is having a very good moment if you if you are happy with your profit book it and uh, close your day look out for other script and then oh. take it take a trade fine sir thank you sir good 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 any other question guys good morning sir hi akshit uh so i didn't get um the blue line thing that you told oh blue line thing that you told that i told okay so i told you about fibonacci right in the class did you yes. attend the class fibonacci right yes yes sir. okay with the fibonacci it creates two different lines here okay in this case i'll show you it creates okay let's 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 do for reliance this is reliance okay reliance so okay here you got the levels created the blue lines created do not yes. tell me that where it is created it is created because of particular two candles okay do not tell okay. anything here in the in the session but there is a candle created okay here also the candle is created okay so and then after that you see it is coming down okay it is coming down a bit okay let me draw you see there is no blue line here it comes and it's this line okay yes sir and then it is still going down and it is going down here and when it goes down and hits this area and if it's reverse right where will be a target my target will be around here right okay okay so that is where is it is so here in this case it is going down and down and down so my target is not on the upside it is still keeping down 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 and it is on the downside so there are some some instance where it touches on the lower side it touches on the upside so i want to show that i told you now whenever it is like a pendulum when it's it's one level it has to hit the same level there so same thing if if you have a level at the bottom blue level here if it it's here my target will be on the upper side the same blue line means if on on the lower side it's hitting the yeah. first lower level yeah. Yeah. so on the upper side the target should be the first higher level exactly the first higher level so that is what the blue line is if the first line if the blue line hits first on the top it should come down for the blue line on the lower level so that is like a pendulum kind of a movement okay so sir is there any time period that we should expect or uh, when... it is not a time period it can go within a fraction of uh, 15 minutes or it can wait for another 1 hour 2 hours or 3 hours or one day or two days also but whenever the first time it it's it, there will be opposite reaction there will be a second time there will be a hit on the upside so when this movement is complete this line is also complete okay, okay. so and the line will be keep on drawing so you should uh, avoid it so whenever it happens like this a particular line is formed and then there are three different lines are formed and then when the stocks comes and it's the first line you need to wait for the isi three lines here so it will come hit and it goes and hits this level and it will be hitting this level so that is the target so whenever it's this level you get the target of it this level so when this vertical line comes into play so that means that the earlier fibonacci levels are gone yeah are gone okay yeah. and also sir the uh, the way that you um, taught to draw the sr line support resistance lines on the basis of the oh levels high yeah. so is that required to be made in a uh, while we are using range of market or not i'll repeat okay i'll remove this on for for a clarity purpose i'll just remove it okay so you have this line created right this is a range of the market it is created okay when when this is going above this line right do i have any other lines which is helping me in getting the uh, resistance or support no right no, it sir. is it is breaking the range it is breaking the range of the market and is going on the upper side in that case we should look out for the oh candle support resistance which i taught you we need to look into it so where is the next level you need to go to that particular area and then you need to mark those level so that will give you a, a levels of resistance so it will be acting exactly on the same area 
just watch out so those things you should do and one more thing if you have a support resistance at this level in in the range of the market avoid it because that will not be working on this particular day so this is the range of the market so it will be on this trot and those resistance and support will not work the support and resistance will work only below this range and above this range getting the point but sir i tried when uh, in this trial period i did try that but then the screen was becoming very mess very complicated so that's why i did not had anything drawn right <laughs> okay <laughs> see there are there are there are things to be um, there are there are things to be noted here okay so whenever i um, whenever i do something i usually have a uh, the reference of the previous previous uh, previous uh, years of uh, candlestick study okay so when i do all this candlestick studies and everything i find that the levels which i am marking the dotted lines are like those levels will be your uh, support and resistance levels so it will act like your uh, warriors wherever whenever it cross above this level it goes and it's this level see this it goes and it's this level and goes and it's this level and goes and it's this level there are selling after hitting this level there is selling same thing here whenever it goes and it's that particular area it has to sell i show you it is not there as of now but it will come and hit for support okay so all you have to do is just concentrate that's it you, you should, if you if you think of uh, of the oh candle that i have to mark then i think you don't need a range also i taught you how to mark this uh, range right you can yes, mark sir. with the range and then you use your own uh, strategy that will also fine okay but if you this is a full uh, packed uh, indicator where uh, you don't have uh, to worry about any of your uh, open eye uh, support resistance because everything is carried everything is taken care if you are concentrating on the uh, intraday market so if you are concentrating on the other market like short term or the long term you need to avoid this range of the market and you need to draw those lines if you are a short term or medium term please. okay sir and so we can surely avoid uh, the pitchfork a thing at least <laughs> that we do not need nah nah you do not need you do not need you because i uh, because pitchfork will be telling you exactly at this level is selling okay, okay. No, no need to worry about that everything is taken care okay sir thank you sir no problem go ahead any questions sir good morning sanjay here hi sanjay so you are the first culprit may i ask me to do the work workshop so i did for you <laughs> thanks for identifying me <laughs> chalo uh, okay you took such a, such a great effort so it's yeah. all inclusive yeah yeah, yeah. Uh, i just wanted uh, some few clarifications yes yes can we use this indicator for daily time frame uh daily it will be messy man because in daily time frame uh this this line will be so so irritating for me so let me show you if i do for a day trade day day thing this uh, will be so irritating i do I, i do don't like it because it'll be so irritating right it's so messy yeah. okay so in that case i don't i don't uh, expect you to use my range of the market you have to remove it and then follow my indication what i taught you right that you can do it or if you want to do with the range of the market all you have to do is you need to go for 1 hour or 45 minutes less than that so you get a beautiful level like this okay this so this 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 is another way of uh, uh, learning right so this is like let me let me tell you another one which i already taught my uh, another students like you see this this is uh, this is here and then the range is getting on the upside and it is on the downside but the range is going on the upside again the range is going on the upside again the range is going on the upside again the range is going on the upside so that means that the the script is on the upward move and after that the range is gone below if the range is gone below that means that we are on the short side we can go for a short again 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 a short okay again from here the the trend is taking on the long side so you can go for a long for a particular script it is going long again short but again gone for a long you can go for a long 
long and then sideways this is a sideways pure sideways and then see for that is this on the downside 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 so if you see this as a trending thing it is it will give you a trending kind of a thing which i used to tell my students but i didn't tell anyone here but my followers knows this so this is how we can also mark whether it is a it is a it is downtrend as per the yesterdays and day before yesterday's movement whether the stock is on the downtrend or on the uptrend you can get a uh, clarity on that getting it sanjay yes it's simply beautiful yeah thank you the no, only way the, the only way of how to use it no, how to use it uh, because i didn't tell anyone how to use it if if people use it in a different mindset na no, they get everything clarified Uh, in the in this case, suppose we use forty-five minutes or one hour as a time frame. Yeah. In this case, the support and resistance zone, which uh, which are indicated in the indicator. Yeah, it'll work. It'll work because this indicator is all this line is all about uh, the first line. So which I taught you. So that is that line will be intact. So you don't need to worry about anything. even if you change for uh, 30 minutes or 45 minutes or 1 hour 15 minutes this line will be intact okay there will not be any change there will not be any change to that sir is it to work in the currency uh, in the case of the currency ah in case of currency okay there are so many people are asking for currency um uh, okay if uh, there are people uh, asked me exclusively on currency sir how to do a currency market so uh, who is that venkatesh right is it ajitav 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 i think you already enroll i think you will get that one okay don't worry <laughs> wait for that you already enroll i think you will get that knowledge don't worry but there is a uniqueness that we need to do for uh, Uh, the currency market, which I recently taught to at least seventeen members of the group, so that is on a different way how to do. It's on a different groove how to work on F F X market. It's not with the range of the market because I cannot mark the range of the market because F X market works twenty four by seven. There should be a, a range that I need to mark for uh, taking the trade, which I currently disclose with. the fx market students okay don't worry just now i'll teach you okay mm. himself one more question yeah sanjay yes yes sanjay it's like a bible for me so are we going to upload this on youtube or will it be available yeah. for your students yeah. which one this uh, workshop this audio this audio this video will be available for everyone because i'll be treating this as a guide book for everyone because the previous one doesn't have the other uh, stuff like uh, the hidden support resistance and then there was no clarity on the uh, how to take a trade which i which i see that so that's where i i just want to have a specifically the first star on the indicator because there are so many disturbances on the workshop where people were talking and then uh, there are so many things people will tend to skip it because uh, people are talking i need to watch only how this things works and get bored so that's why i said first one hour i'll be taking the uh, session on the indicator so that whoever watch the watch for first one hour and if they have any question they'll be watching the question there otherwise they don't watch they would don't watch the question as correct so that is the reason i did that so this will be a bible for everyone so where uh, they can use it and take a trade thank you so much Yeah. So one last question, please. Yeah, Akshat. Uh, sir, uh, how to how to select the stocks that will be you know around the range? <laughs> <laughs> I know, yeah. Uh, how many people? I think there are people out here that were been shouting at me. Same, same. You are you are already did everything. So please give me the stock which is coming on the red zone i want to take a trade i want to make money prem why are you not giving that guys i am been terrible with my time you know i have so much of uh, effort have been put on certain certain things but certain things i, I have so much of work pressure and things and i 
do not have any time to do it so as i promised there is a there is a i used to provide you a alert system right alert mechanic system do you remember that you get yes. uh, you get a buy signal so yeah yeah from, from the script, automated script what that script <clears throat> automatically will do is whenever the the reversing is happening from the uh, red line red line or the green line you get a buy or sell signal on the particular script so you can take an entry from there that's what i'm currently planned and it will be out by november <clears throat> yeah. you have to wait because i have another priority which is really running out my head because i want to make an algo for running uh, the script which i make the algo then i don't want my um, customers to uh, uh, you know my students you know students are my customers the students should not have a uh, facing a problem they should be automating their system so that uh, whenever they find a uh, bank nifty or nifty on the particular range and it's falling under my conditions so it will be taking a trade so you get a beautiful 30, 300 points 400 points moment so that is my plans currently and if that works uh, everyone will be making money right so that is my future plan algo from tradingview.com pardon me algo from tradingview.com nee, only nee 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 it is it will be running from my pc and i'll be uh, generating uh, a code i'll be writing a code where it will be directly going and hitting your uh, levels and it will be it will be directly putting your entry into your uh, uh, orders and it will be running profit in your uh, loss in your account no sir algo means uh, automatic uh, automatic uh, trades will happen yeah automatic trades will if i have if i have zero da Uh, so, if you have zero da you need to pay for that um, what is that uh, bridge i think you need to pay for the bridge which is around 2700 rupees for a month there are some other company like samco which doesn't charge you anything for the bridge so what you can do is we can you can have that as a tool and uh, as a company as a broker and you create an id you just give it to me i can add it to my uh, algo which will be generating the script and it will be generating a buy signal and sell signal from there so sir, this which is platform this, you told sir it's samco samco securities no yeah samco securities samco still not securities. still not on so i'll i'll once i develop everything it is still on the starting phase guys so it's still not even uh, it not even started yet it is still in a talk phase there are so many things are involved you know the cost is involved the time is involved and also uh, the number of uh, trades that is involved everything is involved right need to look into those things aspect first and then i have to come back until then uh, there is no uh, as of now till november december there is nothing going to happen for me i am waiting for your listen yeah i am waiting and see my book is pending my indicator is pending my algo is pending my work is pending my teaching is pending everything is pending <laughs> what will i do i am not a good time keeper i think so maybe that is the reason i took everything at the same time and uh, struggling so no, no, sir till then okay. what can we do for like what can the short term plan we just need to make a uh, no, watch you, list and then check all no 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 see all you have to do here is i'll tell you a quick solution okay just go to create a fnd of folders okay like import all your fnd of folders and if you are a bull trader if you are a bull trader right if you are a bull trader whenever the first 15 minutes you find a shorting levels of any of the candles do not take the first 3 or 5 do not take the first three and if you see a stock which is less than 1% minus 1% take that script alone like 1.75 1.72 take that script alone okay watch that script alone that will give you a entry around this area so watch for that so if you see that uh, hdfc life is around 1.2 so it is around this level right same thing you just watch it Oh, uh, you on the first attempt. It is not. It is on the upside. Okay, you should watch at the first fifteen minutes. Watch out for the script which is minus one percent or two percent, and then see whether it is hitting this area. If it's hitting this area, 
you should concentrate on this particular script on the upside if you are a bad trader you want to go for a short look out for the script which is less than 2% up 2% up so you get a stock which is around this area so that's where you try to short it so that is the only solution as of now you don't have other solution as of now getting it you getting the point why i'm saying 2% is when a stock moves up from here yeah a rejection will be at 1% or 2% so that is where the rejection will happen so when you, when the stock is almost at 2% you get the rejection from there and if you short it you get a money getting the point why it is important select the stock which is around minus 1.5 to 2 in the lower side and then select a stock which is 2% 1.5 to 2% on the upside for the shorting side on the first 15 minutes like first 15 minutes that 9:30 you need to check after 9:30 please do not check 9:30 you just check what are the scripts and then work on those scripts alone or okay and uh, if 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 you if you are a, if you are my favorite followers of open equal to high candles look out for the second or third open eye candles and then take a entry you will find a beautiful trades okay just go through the video which i taught you you will get a very good results okay any other question hello sir how are you hi manan how I'm are you hello sir okay you are asking for you are asking for cost and all brother see uh, yes. this is this <laughs> see uh, this is uh, this is a completely a jam pack right is this a jam pack tool or not yes it has everything out of here even if you see something uh, outside the market right you will not get the entire stuff like what i've done they have uh, separate separately they would have given you a price action they would have given you the range they would have given you something 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 and it not that so accurate as i taught you na whatever yes, i taught you i implemented in this tool and some 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 i did not ta taught you but those are been added to here here so those are uh, those are simple simple thing which i don't want to teach because those are not simple things those are those are so so uniqueness to it so this that needs to have some kind of a appreciation to it otherwise it, it nothing yes right? sir Right, that sure. that is a reason uh, i not teaching those things but other stuffs are main thing which as i really taught you like this i taught you this red line i taught you this blue green blue line i taught you i taught you on this range i taught you on this um, this under candle moving average i taught you on this uh, predictable range right i i i taught you everything yes only sir on this flag only on the overbought zone i didn't teach you other than that everything i taught you and also on the indicator like buy and sells indicator i did not teach you other stuff everything i taught you so yes sir so what else so whatever i taught i put it as an indicator it is not like a lagging indicator it's an what it is just a indicator for you to take action and yes, basically sir. basically my stuff everyone will say i am a contract trader yes i am a contract trader i am not a trend trader you know i don't trade as the market goes by i should be like an institutional player when i am institutional players i always think opposite of the retailers when i think opposite of a retailer that means when retailers are buying i'll be selling when i am buying right. retailers will be selling so right. that is how it will be so that is how the indicator is all about when people are trying to sell i'll be buying from that level so that right. is a contra so that is like a contra If people are buying i'm selling i'm selling i'm buying so that <laughs> that is a case where you get more money if uh, if i'm if i'm again with the retailers now i'll be get, taking a trade wherever wherever this is forming here i'll be going for a trade and then i'll get into a trouble and then i'll fall back right right yeah so that will be avoided then you have the indicator rightly with you because without we can also mark without the indicator we have taught you without marking the indicator but yes sir if if you just go for a sale now if you just go for a trade you need to mark again again for ongc you need to mark again it's yes. just one point where you see okay okay it is on the same level okay it is on the same level okay this is where the buy level this is where the sell level so you get in the one click you get to know everything like you have uh, the first level second level third level where the levels are which is buy sell sell level buy level 
everything as a single glance you get to you, your whatever the learn, learning that i taught you will be coming directly to your mind you know when you get into this mind na you will not right. you will not end up in a losing trade you will be in a buying trade and you will be getting a good profits right sir and how is your ca is going on brother <laughs> i've given, given my exam sir i'll be okay. getting for result okay hope you did a great job this time <laughs> <laughs> yes sir hoping that you clear this time yes sir thank you good 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 any other how are you i was asking about your health too how are you um i'm i'm keeping okay uh, but uh, not that bad i'm keeping okay i'm considering my health too so let's see okay sir hope you like the uh, session today sir, yes, sir. this is again vankatesh varan ah uh, vankatesh sir you told you have lot of jobs you a lot of uh, things to do and you are not getting time correct uh just i am from frankly asking you yeah. if you have some clerical kind of work can you share it cleric no sir i i need a programmer who can write program for me is there any programmer available for <laughs> <laughs> clerical job i already a clerical nahi it's not a clerical job a uh, content writer already i found one person and he is opted for me in writing it and uh, i think i'll be giving it to him for the writing so he'll be the best person to write because he, he is there in the content writing for almost uh, very 30 25 30 years so he, he is very good in writing and uh, i think he will give you a clarity on the writings too in the book which i'm going to create so that will be given to him but i need a person who can write code for me And in uh, in which platforms are uh, I need I need a person who can write code in Python. So Python. If, uh, yeah, Python and uh, someone who can write Python script for me. And those things, if that is there, na, I I I'll take him as my own employee and then start working with him. So that's what I can do <laughs> yeah, because I don't have money. And first of all, I need money for developing anything. Now, if I want to develop, I am doing another work. So, if I have someone who can work on it, and if I get money from the indicator, I can pay for it. If I'm not getting anything, right? I cannot. I cannot put my twenty-four hours into the same thing and creating everything for. Yes, sir, I under I understood that. That's yeah. why I asked you. Okay, yeah. so if I if I work, uh, you if I if I share your works, so yeah. I will get knowledge also. definitely okay. sir that that so, level so, sir if you if you can do it do code for me i'll be really happy for it i i will first check it first and i will come to you come back to you definitely sir i am a mechanical engineer so okay. uh, i learned it but uh, if i if i am able to learn and come back to you let let, let i will inform uh, you. definitely sir i i so if, if i can give you some kind of a small work whether you can do that work and then see whether you can come out with an uh, result for that when you have that result na then i'll give you some more uh, advanced stage of it so that you can get to it and then finally if everything is fine right you can, how, how long that you are making the indicator how long you can make a a strategy out of it then you get uh, you, you get uh, my entire strategy to you so that you can work on it there are people out there they are, they are very good coders i want them to speak they are not speaking Guys, you I know there are people out there who are very good Python codes. Who are there? Please talk, yar. Who knows Python? No one. Sir, no. are you a software engineer? Yes, I am a software engineer. That's why oh. I can create now indicators. <laughs> okay, sir. Okay, sir. Okay. I I but basically I'm not a programmer. I'm sir, a, this I'm a, this uh, script is running on which platform, sir? This script is running on Pine Script. This is a Pine Script editor. Pine Script. So, is it Pine a separate script. script from Python? Uh, yeah, it is a code. It's a editor which is a it is a code uh, developed by the trade uh, trading web platform. They have developed a code for it. So, you have to use this code for writing the indicators. Okay, sir. I will check and come back to you. Definitely, sir. Take care. any other question guys we are running out of time uh, i can take two more questions and then we'll wind off any any other questions last questions or anything and don't forget to put your profile id training bureau profile id in the chat window otherwise i will not be giving access to it i'll show you there are i'll show you something okay your ids are getting expired by today okay
Uh, morning, sir. Who's that? Hey. Yeah, I am Tito. Tito here. Hi, Tito. How are you? Yeah, it's a long time sorry, for you, I man. Join very late. It's okay, brother. Brother, I think it's Sunday. I should have started somewhere the afternoon. I am busy for that. Sorry for that. So see, yeah, for me, your, I, most of your people have um, enjoy gone down here. Let's see. Um, let's see. I see. I I say Tito. Tito, you you have yeah. access to it? Yeah. See, today yeah, is the expiry access. day. Every everyone has an expiry day today. So today you get your uh, IDs get expired. Let's say Akil, Akil Raj, your ID is already expired. Okay. So there are like. Um, Arpit, Arthur. Let's say I say Deepak. Deepak is also what's there, na? Deepak Pillai, your expiry on twenty third. So, so some people these are like April students, so they have access till uh, one month, and then I will also extend it for you guys. Don't worry. So whoever joins here today, please post your uh, uh, ID so that I'll, I'll change accordingly for everyone. So okay? one doubt. Uh... Yeah, uh, is it uh, works with uh, cru uh, commodities like crude oil and all? Yes. Come on, it works on crude oil very much, yeah. See, do okay, you want to see fine. crude oil? I'll show you crude oil. Okay, this is crude oil. Okay, first. So this is the range of the crude oil. Okay, breaking this range, where it is going? Okay, see this. This is the range. Range broke here. So where it is going? Okay. This is the range breakout here, and then it's selling. It is on the range. Okay. okay. Do not worry, guy. It works on everything. No, no. Uh, the thing is that I confuse like that. The the green line means that that is the maximum limit that it can go. No, no, no. If it crosses this level, this is a range. Yeah, on a particular yeah. day, this is a range that it can go. Okay. But if it goes above that, that means that the stock has a tendency to on going on the upside. Okay, it okay, is breaking fine. the range, right? You have a you have option chain where uh, you have the upper limit and the lower limit, and when it breaks the upper limit, the short covers short people will cover for long. So short covering happens. So this is where the short covering happens and it goes on the upside. Okay, up to up to what level it can go maximum? I I uh, said now there are three levels I given here: one, two, and three. See first okay. level, second level, it got rejection. Okay. You're getting this dot now, you have this dot. You okay. get this dot, and that's where the rejection happens. Okay, fine. Okay. And thank you, sir. I, I, I am the I am using only your like uh, the wow, voice that's... strategy for all my like trading. Everyone are using man. Everyone are using my strategy, mm -hmm. but they're not telling me. That's very bad. Someone sometime they will be telling. Okay, I'm using a strategy. Otherwise, they will not tell. Also, but uh, yeah, people people can, is... should open it. People should open up saying that this is what I'm working. Sir, please help me in whatever the things that you want to do. I'll help you. I'm there to help. The thing is that I attend one more like uh, like uh, like I got a free chance to attend some of the like training course. Yeah. But still, uh, after that, once I attend that uh, class. Uh -huh. I feel that this is the right one actually. Oh, it's strategy. Exactly. It's brother. working. It's working, right? You will so, see there are lots of working, and you try to get so access it... to the recent <laughs> batch videos. You know, the recent batch video, like I did for I'm doing for April batch. You try to get the access to the April batch videos, which will be more precise. It will be more accurate. So April batch students are very, 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 very. uh you know they are like, like they are like expert right now because they get the content with the creamy content you know whatever the content which i did for you they okay. they have the creamy part they have the excellent part you know the, you are the first batch the second batch the third batch right they have they have been i've been doing for almost uh, one year now so they get the knowledge on the experience level so so they 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 grasp it and they work extremely well so you try to get access to the recent videos try to talk with the uh, team and then sir i need the recent video of prime sir just ask him maybe you get provided you get provided for that you just ask them and see what is going on 
please okay. do not watch the your your own video please ask them sir i've been with your with your thing company so i want to see whether is there anything that been changed by prem sir if you can give access to that video it will be very good for us just post a video na you have all rights okay. to ask the ask a question please close the video and ask for the things you can you will get it whoever ask uh, the support they will be providing for you so you just ask that and then please revise it say that i want to revise it uh, what uh, whatever the prem sir is teaching right now just if you can uh, have that also to our uh, things you get you get much clarity into it so just watch that do not uh, do not watch your own videos you will get you get sometimes you get uh, not the clarity you not get the same clarity with uh, the thing, other things if i uh, if i want then in the position i'll be granting you the access for the recent videos right yeah sure thanks sir yeah 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 go 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 and ask you have all right now post your question there <laughs> okay any other questions guys hi not... hi who is that uh, this is deepak hi deepak hey um, sorry i accidentally I, will... i i picked you sorry for that <laughs> uh, i'm sorry i accidentally picked you in the thing to the show you show everyone oh. so no worries <laughs> okay just go ahead oh. deepak yeah. okay So I, I'm I'm from the setback. Um, I know. Yeah. I, I, yeah. Actually, I couldn't able to you know due to some of the issues yeah. I was not on the classes. I was watching the video. Yeah. You know, I I found uh, things are uh, as very interesting. Yes. You know, yes. Basically. Yes. Uh, especially with the oil scandal. Uh, yeah. You know. Um, yeah. That that was something very new to me. And, yeah. Uh, you know, I I think new to everybody. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So uh, even the tool, um, actually, I'm uh, I'm I'm starting to use this. You know, as I said, you know, I had some medical emergency, so I was not uh, yeah. totally pouring things out. Correct. Uh, you know, when I was uh, looking into this, the lines which you are which you draw, uh, I have uh, a little bit doubt around that because no. when you taught uh, taught us, um, you know, on the videos you said uh, uh, based on the first candle, second candle, okay. and the third candle, you are making it first candle. You know, one point five. Uh, above and below yeah. so there are two lines right two support and resistance lines you are you are drawing so first line i understood that is 1.5 come on come on go, don't do not disclose anything there we'll okay. talk later okay, <laughs> all, okay. The, all the points and everything so you're so talking about the first line and the second line right you yeah. said the first line and the second line and yeah. i'll take you on that i think i oh, okay. i i i did i did uh, the ex- explanation was there in the video na no? is there in the video right Uh, so I, I I have doubt about the second line. I mean, first line I'm I'm clear, but okay, the second, second line, line I'm not I'm not getting it. Okay, I'll I'll teach you. Okay, just okay. after this meeting, just uh, just ping me. I'll 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 show you. Sure. Oh, okay. So this is not only for stock pro. That that's what you're saying. No, no, no. Don't tell the uh, names. Yeah. Okay. It is not a recording. <laughs> I'm sorry. Okay. Fine. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I'm good, but uh, things are uh, you know I I found this as interesting you know uh, going behind uh, FIIs and all. Uh, um, yeah. O- only thing, only uh, some 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 clarity I don't have is around that. This one uh, definitely I'll I'll talk to you on offline about the race. Yeah. You know. Uh, so this is uh, not for the race, brother. This yeah. is not for the race. And please uh-huh. do not talk about the race. We have a separate session for race. Okay. Okay. I, I'll give access to everyone and I'll talk for the race. So, uh-huh. so race I don't want to disclose anywhere here because it's, okay. it's completely on okay. my priority and it's on yeah. my uh, uh, my own kitty, my own my own child which I developed. So uh-huh. no one can claim it. I developed that race and uh, I've been giving it for uh, for my students. But okay. after that, na. so uh-huh. i i have developed something uh, the fourth array which i developed which i don't want to disclose as of now i'll be showing it, i'll be giving it for uh, the usage for everyone and mm-hmm. see how this works out but not now and there are so many things to be done so i'll just want that to be carried out first and then i'll be giving it for uh, at least a uh, one month two months for a trial for that you people can look into the race but i have given access to most of my followers now uh, who really want the race i just gave them uh and then they are watching it and yeah. yeah so that is what if people are eagerly waiting for me and wants to work with me they can uh, have this indicator and then they can do it 
Sure, sure. I like, like frauds is more, uh, you know, uh, as I said, you know, probably I, I wouldn't be able to use it much, but uh, yeah. I found things as interesting. I, uh, you know, whenever I observed it, it is perfectly taking support and resistance. Definitely, yes. Uh, yeah. Seems yes. interesting. Yes, it is interesting. It will be interesting, brother. Yeah, I'll I'll use it much more and uh, I'll I'll share the comments. So tell me, all my sessions were interesting, na? Every session was unique, and every session you had uh, ice breakers, right or wrong? Yeah, yeah, but yeah, it was it was unique. First of all, things were unique, probably you know something which uh, I never heard. Uh-huh. You know, those those were around there. Yeah, yeah it nice. was perfectly some research right. things out there. Right. Yeah, yeah. Great yeah, man, nice, uh, really, and uh, all the best. Probably you would be doing more research again and again, right? So definitely, brother. There are so much research are going on, <laughs> and currently I'm doing the research on the uh, Fibonacci levels, which I already started uh, providing. Uh, I've been asking the uh, institution for giving me a chance for teaching uh, that particular uh-huh. strategies, because that is a, that takes around twenty a sixteen to twenty years of training. So oh, okay. it will be a separate. course that uh, we need you know i i don't want a bigger course like the 40k 50k no it's just for mm-hmm. mere 15k or 10k 15k uh, uh, with everything covered uh, it's okay. fine na so that kind of a thing which i'm uh, looking out for the institution that uh, still i'm not getting it uh, from the institution if i get something out of that then uh, you'll find it from the course otherwise i should take it outside i should take uh, the session from outside uh, who are interested in taking that course can take it come and take it from me because it just met 10k where you can uh, get the course for free and also you get the indicator for life long there are people coming for uh, sir i need the indicator for life long life long i need this indicator for life long mm-hmm. so i just give the indicator for life long yeah you take it so at least uh, you you get uh, if you say you see i'm i'm giving it for free because you are a student right you are my students and you've been watching my videos and everything so if i my students i want to give them a special treat like i want to give them another round of uh, training which is which is much 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 more unique and much 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 more uh, effective and much 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 more fruitful on getting the right entry so when mm-hmm. that all covered together what happens you get a very good result so when they pay for it like 10k for that they get a lifetime free access to the indicator uh, i don't need at all i i see i am not a person for money here, but i want someone to learn uh, someone to learn right if i give it for free people what happens is thinking that i i'm just giving a nonsense stuff and uh, at least my my i should respect my own uh, r&d right i sh- i should respect yeah. my own r&d how much time i have spent on that if someone respect on that aspect right they don't think that 10k is small it, it is not a big one it's just very small amount but mm-hmm. when they see as a whole thing right you're paying for 10k you're learning something very unique things and then you're coming back and seeing that you have the indicator for life long Is sir, what uh, yeah. sir, you told this course Fibonacci uh, course will be conducted on September. Sir, wait, sir. I'll I'll do not talk down that, sir. Who's that? Venkates. <laughs> Chalo, this this is like a person who is respecting. He was asking for a uh, sir. Please teach me <laughs> Fibonacci. I am just teaching it. Okay. So <laughs> now I have to now I have to uh, trim the Q and A session for another another. 20 minutes last 20 minutes i need to trim when vengades was talking and other things was talking i should trim otherwise I, it's not good so i should trim that uh, but this is what will happen guys you know uh, if 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 i have been asking for a course if that is not been provided then i have to do it outside right so um, if you want to attend it's not i am not pushing you to attend like if you want to have attendant to the course you can attend the course and then you take it from there you give, you have the access to the indicator for life long and you have the support from me i think people knows about me when when they get the support right when they get the support from me when they get the support of the indicator then they get the support of the knowledge right 10k is very very small guys you get 10k earned in matter of uh, just one day i uh, sumit is there sumit Okay, I'll tell yes, you one. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, Mit, uh, how much did you earn for a whole uh, last all this five months? 
it's around almost uh, more than 40k 40k yeah okay there is another smith okay there is another smith who had a loan of around uh, 10.5 lakhs who had a loan of 10.5 lakhs and after attending my sessions and after attending uh, and is close follower of me he closed his loan in just 2 months he is now in profit and he is already closed his entire loans and he is very much happy with that if you want i can i can put forward to him right you can see how well uh, the 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 amount that he got yeah who is that who is that chalo if 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 that is not the case uh, we can uh, wind up today and uh, let's see and please leave your profile id guys if you are not leaving your profile id your indicator will not be working from tomorrow i repeat it again and again please 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 put your trading id there okay with that i'm closing for the session guys enjoy your day enjoy your weekend and uh, bye bye take care it's been nice thank you so much you. sir thank, thank you sir. thank you very much thank you very much bye 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 bye